Hello, Brandies. Sorry, sorry, had to change the intro from pumpkins to Brandies because, oh yeah. But never mind about that. What I wanted to say is the first day of Christmas, we're going to head to our grandma's for like a Christmas dinner, I guess. And what I wanted to say is these are the socks that I got yesterday. And I have not noticed, not till now, that they are the advent calendar socks. See, they have like this ribbon to hang them onto the chimney and each of them has a number pinned to it so that, you know, it's a day and it has 24 numbers. So it's 24 socks and 24 days. How amazing is that? Today I'm gonna go for... Hmm, which one do I want to wear? I'm thinking you. You, Mr. Reindeer. Thank you very much. And the second sock would be, I'm thinking, maybe you, Mr. Snowman. Okay, and so I am ready and steady to go, even though I'm not sure whether this, you know, shirt will suit with this. But I just wanted to feel the coziness of my new jumper and also wanted to wear this Christmassy shirt because it's with snowmans. I don't know whether you noticed, but it is with snowmans. And I wanted to wear both, and so I decided whatever who cares like really who cares and i am wearing this new bag as well so it's all fancy and christmassy i would say it feels like autumn right now like it feels like a very magical lovely autumn because it's like the combination of dead trees and the sun so it's great it's so magical so lovely so beautiful and i'm rocking this turtleneck really Mm -hmm. it's the turtleneck made out of my jumper if you have not noticed that so cute. But yeah, we'll be in Grandma's in three, two, one. We're in Grandma's right now, as you can see, by this not ours Christmas tree. And I just wanted to touch a very touchy topic. My grandma served us a soup with meat. She literally mixed it into the soup so that we will not know that there's meat in it. And the first spoon I took, the first spoon my sisters took, when we were like is it meat in there? Like, you can taste it. You can taste it by the fat. You can taste it by the taste. It tastes like blood. And then I'm like, I can see the fibers, like little tiny miniature fibers swimming in the soup. And I bumped onto a cartilage while chewing on it. And I was like, no, ew, this is definitely with meat. So that's like unfun. Like, don't do it to people. Like, why would it matter for you that someone doesn't eat meat? You you can't, you can't force eating meat onto a vegetarian, onto a vegan, that is, that is so bad that I was so disgusted, I wanted to vomit, like, it was so awful, like, why would you do that to me? It was like a nightmare, like some psycho, psycho thing, I was so disgusted. And I mean, don't do that, we vegans and vegetarians, we are who we are. We live the way we are because we love animals and we want to protect them and we want to save them. What's wrong with that, really? We don't make you go vegan and vegetarian. We just live the way we live and we don't kill them. And it's our decision. So please respect it at least. Like, it's so sad. My own grandma, really. <sighs> respect it at least, please. Like, and so now it's another day. I wanted to say something about yesterday. What is, we watched the adventures of Tintin with my cousin. And it's so amazing. Like, I love it so much. It's a bit steampunky, isn't it? It is a steampunk, I think. Like, it's an adventure story. But I think it's a bit of a steampunk. And steampunk is lifestyle. Like, I love steampunk so much. If you don't know what steampunk is, Google it. It's so beautiful. So amazingly beautiful. It's a dream. And I love it like it's so beautiful but now without any further ado i shall move on to the socks the winner of today's daily sock is i'm thinking you sir and the another one will be will be you santa Okay, I must tell you, I don't know why, but my breakfast contained of a slow coffee, what is a coffee that I make in America, and it's like brute coffee, and not an instant coffee that I drink, like, on 
the weekdays because I'm at work and I'm scurrying and having no time. And slow coffee is also with coconut milk because coconut milk is not processed. It's not like chemical like the soy milk is, unfortunately. So slow coffee is mocha coffee, brute one, and with coconut and it's great. And I just had it myself because I have time today. Plus what my breakfast contained as well is plums and chocolate. I know, mm, but you know, why not? And another thing I wanted to say is about coconut oil and my hair. Because my hair, let me tell you, my hair are a nightmare. I wash my hair every two days, but I honestly should do it every day. They get all oily and unpleasant and all after just one day. And on Friday, I just thought to myself, maybe use coconut oil, because coconut oil is good for everything. And so I rinsed my hair with water, added the coconut oil onto the skin of my head and then just washed it with the shampoo that I always use. And it was on Friday, Friday morning and we have Monday right now and there's still no need for me to wash my hair. Amazing? I think so. So coconut oil is the miracle the baby Jesus gave us, okay? Okay. So I'm all dressed now and ready to kick some asses this day and I don't know why am I updating you with literally everything but I guess I must have just missed this normal regular daily vlogging. And what I wanted to say is I'm dressed in this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous shirt. You see it has this little gentleman all in there and it's lovely because I love such little gentlemen. And so it's another day and it's past 6am, I am heading to work and I am completely very sleepy. Plus it's super cool outside, I decided to wear this jumper cardigan and I think I'm going to pick my socks right now. Three, two, oh, I see you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, and you would do. Now it's billion years later and I'm off to work already. Today has passed so, so fast and that is amazing. I mean, comparing to yesterday, Yesterday, I have not told you what happened yesterday. Yesterday, my friend, our family's friend, I guess, uh, came over to us like for a dinner and then like she stayed and we were watching films and it was all so lovely. Like I love such lovely time. You know that very well. So yesterday was awesome and it was passing so slow because it was an awesome day and awesome days tend to pass slow. What is great, I think, like a great time passes slowly because a lot of things are happening, indeed they do. So yeah, and work was passing quick so that is good as well. And the weather, the weather is super cozy because it's cloudy and cloudy is my thing when it comes to weather. Like see, yeah, you do see cloudy weather. I love it. The air is so fresh, like wintry, but very, very sharp and fresh. And the rain is still drizzling, but it no more smells with rain. What is good because rain does not have like a very pleasant smell, does it? So that is basically all I want to say. I am heading to meet my friend right now. Okay, so I'm at Anne's now. This is Anne. This is Han. Hello. Hi. Yeah, and. We are having some awesome time being lazy and trying to play for Lella. But yeah, it's you crazy. What? <laughs> you crazy. Ukulele, okay. Okay, if so. I yeah. can play ukulele. No. She can. And you were playing for the first time today, weren't you? Yes. Yeah. yeah, that's so weird. I've been playing for like a year and I cannot play a thing. And it's yours. Yeah, it's mine, but I could play it. <laughs> no, oh, I can. Yeah. I, 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 I wish to. <laughs> you wish to. Bravo. 
Bravo. Bravo you. Yeah, no, I can't. I can't play. Well, you can yeah. apparently. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, like five chords. <laughs> well, it's better than nothing. I can play four. Yes, yeah, yeah, your socks are the best. Dinosaur socks, so beautiful, yes. so fancy, and socks are the best. A teddy in the world. bear with us today. Yes, and with you always. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love to hug him and hold him close yes. and sleep with him. Yes, and cuddle. Yeah. Okay. That's my little hugger. Okay. Uh, does he have a name? No. No name. You hug him Love all the me. time. And... <laughs> no name, nameless. Okay, a nameless teddy bear. It's, it's just, so... it's just a teddy. Okay, okay. So yeah, and thank you for having a great time with you and watching Peter Pan. Yeah, watching mm -hmm. Peter Pan. We were because we're in the theater all together, and they were playing in a Peter Pan, and I just watched it, and it was so cute. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Hello, hey. An outro. Okay. Bye.